All right, so this uh, video is going to be just a preview. Um, this is going to be a preview of my RPG Basics series. Um, and the reason I'm going to be doing this um, is for many reasons. I think a lot of people focus on uh, immersion and telling people in the community what um, they want in their group. And I think every group is different. You know, some people enjoy the hack and slash. Some people like the heavy role play. You know, some people like miniatures. Some people don't like miniatures. Um, some people like more player world interaction. You know, for instance, same old G's video that I did a response to. He wants his players to help create his world. Other, you know, uh, groups want the GM to be in control of the world. You know, so there's a lot of factors and you need to find the right group for you. So I'm going to be doing an RPG Basics series. And in this, I'm not going to tell people how they should play their game. Um, because I think as a community, we've made it... Um, for a new player, we've made it a little intimidating. You know, you tell them this is the one way to play, that's how you play, and that's it. Now, don't get me wrong, I do agree with a lot of what you guys say, um, but it's very different for different groups. I've played with people who didn't want the same thing out of role-playing as me. Um, I've played with people who you know, like the heavy dice rolling and, um, you know, lots of role playing and, you know, mystery and, uh, you know, a lot of that. So, um, personally, I think I'm more in the middle on a lot of the topics that we've discussed in this community than others. Um, but that's just me. So in my basic series, um, I, right now, this is what I think I'm going to go over. Um, it's going to be simple stuff. What is a tabletop RPG? How do you play a tabletop RPG? Um, how do you GM a tabletop RPG? Uh, I'm going to talk about miniatures versus imagination. Um, I'm going to talk about different styles of play. Um, and overall, in all my videos, I think the main thing that I want to emphasize is that is it's a lot easier than some of these channels make it seem, okay? And so I want to get that across to new players, is that it's easier than it seems. Uh, I want to really emphasize this because I want this to be something that if someone who's just bought the books and hasn't played yet, finds any channel or any series that I do, I'd want them to find this one. Um, I don't want them to be intimidated, you know, by the amount of words that are in the book, the amount of rules, because ultimately, you know, I know we call it words like crunch and things like that, but ultimately the rules are just a guideline. They're not necessarily a, they're an opinion almost. Um, you can play a game throw half the rules out the window, and still have a great time with the right group. So, and, you know, when it comes to rules personally, if I don't know a rule on the spot, I wing it. I, I try not to let it bog my game down. Um, I'll make a note and go back to it after the game, and you know, sometimes I'll remember it five minutes later in-game, but I don't retro, I don't go back and say, oh, actually, you know, take another six points of damage or, you know, I just, I like to keep things flowing as much as I can. So, um, and if I don't know a rule, you know, I just wing it. So if a player catches it, you know, okay, we'll, we'll go with it. Uh, but yeah, so that's kind of what I'm thinking about this series. Um, if there's anything else you can think that I should cover in this, uh, that would be great. Um, but yeah, I, I think uh, it's something that a lot of us overcomplicate. So I just want to make it simple. Um, and I don't want players to feel overwhelmed with having to do it a certain way. Um, so yeah, that's it. Um, tell me what you think. Anything I should add to the series. Because um, I know there's a lot of things that I'm wanting 
you know, that I will want to do that I just, in brainstorming, wasn't able to think of. So, so this is kind of like a preview, but it's also a help me um, expand on the series to make it as positive and informative as I can for new players. Um, maybe there's something that even veterans can take from it. So just let me know. Um, I'd love to hear what you think. Thanks. Bye.